the garage, and uh, I ended up talking, getting the two people out, and, uh, the cat. And by the time we got them out, the whole house was in gold. Well, this was a real roadside rescue. A AAA worker saw a Grafton house on fire and got the elderly couple inside out safely. The former volunteer firefighter jumped right into action. WBC's Ken McLeod picks up the story for us tonight, live in Grafton. Ken? Paula, when fire erupted in this house this afternoon, homeowner Randall Rixham and his wife were not here, but his elderly in-laws were. Now, fortunately, the fire erupted on this near end of the house, and the elderly couple was in that far end of the house, and that bought just a little bit of time for a passing Good Samaritan. As firefighters drowned the smoldering house this afternoon, Norman Strom was still unimpressed by his heroic deed. Otherwise, now it's another day. Hardly. The AAA worker was on his way to help someone locked out of their car in Grafton just before 12.30 when he saw this on Millbury Street. The former volunteer firefighter jumped from his truck and started banging on the door. They ended up not knowing that it was on fire, so they were sitting on their couch thinking nothing of it. The 86-year-old couple alone inside are Randall Rixom's in-laws. He knocked on the doors and got, got my, my in-laws had no idea that it was burnt there on the opposite end of the house. And at first, the elderly couple was a hard sell. I had to go in and get them out because they wouldn't come out because they didn't think it was nothing wrong until they see the smoke. And then it started coming through the walls. Indeed, this is what the four alarm blaze looked like just minutes after Strom helped the couple out, with just time enough to fetch some personal items and the family cat. They got the cat out, which I'm amazed at because the cat usually hides from everything. <laughs> the cat was a little more stubborn. Strom says he's glad he was in the right place at the right time, but the flames destroyed everything. We're going to do some remodeling, but <laughs> not on this scale. Obviously, the homeowner's sense of humor is intact. But things might well have been different had the humble AAA man not been passing by. It's just something I do every day. So helping people out is just what people should do. That's all. Norm and Jean Daigle are the elderly couple saved here. They were checked out at the hospital, and they're okay staying at their grandson's house tonight. Fortunately, everybody was standing well back from the house when a propane tank in that garage exploded. Live in Grafton tonight, Ken McLeod, WBZ News.